Hi, my name is Elise, and today I'm going to be bringing you along on my first day after transferring to a four-year college. It is currently 8.37, but I figured I would take you guys with me today because it is kind of like a new chapter in my journey, so it's always cool to bring you guys with me when that happens. Let's get this day started. So I just got dressed as you saw and I just packed up my backpack and I think I'm gonna probably grab a snack since I'm gonna be at school pretty much all day. Um, so I'm gonna grab a snack and then I'll be ready to head out. Since it's the first day I'm actually just bringing my laptop and like a little notepad to keep notes and keep track of my homework because I think I can pretty much just document everything on my computer. I'll probably be using Google Docs a lot for taking notes and keeping up with assignments and that sort of stuff. And I'm just gonna make another chai tea for the road. Okay, so I am off now and ready to go. I actually just packed up some oranges and some blueberries and I have some like nuts in the car and now I'm gonna set up the music and we're gonna head on out okay so I just made it to my parking spot and I actually have to take a shuttle because my parking spot is so far and I literally saw the shuttle pull up right as I did so I think I have like 10 minutes until the next shuttle so I guess I'm gonna start walking to the stop there cuz I'm kind of even parked far away from the shuttle stop um, and yeah, I'll take some clips on my phone so you can see the action. <laughs> Alright, so I'm back in the car now. I just was able to get a few clips because it was actually super packed on campus today. I have to park in the south side of campus and all my classes are at the very top of north campus. So I have to take the shuttle and the shuttle is super packed. Literally people were standing up in the aisles because there weren't even that many seats. Um, it wasn't as packed on the way to class but definitely super packed on the way back and it kind of took a while for the shuttle to get there after I had been waiting after class, so it is now 12.40. My class actually started at 11 and ended at 12.15, and I don't think I have enough time to go back home to eat. I don't think I have enough time to go stream, so I think I'm just gonna drive a little bit around and try to make my way back here, of course, by two, because my next class starts at two. I haven't been to any of my classrooms that I have to go to today as well, so I'm kind of giving myself some leeway time so that I can find the classrooms as well. I did get to my first class actually like 7 minutes, no, actually like 10 minutes before it started. I thought I was going to be late, but I was there 10 minutes ahead. And now I think I'm going to go drive around. Uh, my goal is to be back here by 1.30, so I have 45 minutes. So my car actually says that it's 31 degrees, which isn't too cold, especially since yesterday it was literally like 5 degrees Fahrenheit, so I think I'm gonna go and go on a little hike. I stopped at a park and we'll see how long I last because it does feel pretty cold, but apparently it's 30 degrees, which isn't too cold. Whoa, part of the river is frozen. <laughs> That's sick. Oh, and the like, beach is frozen. That's so cool.
So I made it back to the parking lot and I'm actually way closer to the shuttle like I'm lit I can look at the shuttle right now it's like right in front of me basically but literally I was just like looking at my phone real quick right before I got out and the shuttle <laughs> drove by that keeps happening today the shuttle keeps driving by right before I get to it like today it's happened two times where like I literally was like about to get on like so close like literally like just around getting to the bus and I just it just pulled away so tragic but it only takes like 10 minutes but I've noticed that like there's this one shuttle that goes around this way like around south campus and then back through here so I have to get the one that's going exactly the way that I just missed it oh great what that was so fast that was not 10 minutes <laughs> all right I guess, oh, I'm so confused. I thought the next one would be like this going down towards the south campus, but then there was another one that's north campus. I should get my house out there. I need to pee too. All right, peace. <sighs> okay, so I just got back to the car. It's 5.05, .05. I have class at 5.50, and I'm just gonna chill out, um, and then I'll, you know, leave for the shuttle soon. I'm still, you know, pretty close to the shuttle because I haven't moved my car. Um, the last two classes that I just went to, let's break it down, so I had corporate, no, 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 so I had business analytics first, um, well, technically it was my second class, but since I've seen you, that was the first class I had, and that is supposed to be the hardest business class there is, so we'll see how I do, and <laughs> then I had marketing research. I keep missing the freaking shuttle though by like seconds, like literal seconds, and it's annoying. <laughs> but I have 20 minutes until I'm gonna get on the shuttle and I'm kinda just gonna enjoy the sunset. I can't really see it too much right now, but I can watch the colors change. But yeah, I guess I'll catch up with you when I also get back to my car again after this next class. Uh, I'll probably get some, you know, B-roll in between. Okay, I literally have to use a flashlight because I just got back to my car at 7 o'clock and it's pitch black. Oh my goodness. Uh, I'm gonna go home now and eat. I literally haven't had a meal since breakfast when I ate that burrito this morning. I snacked on some blueberries that I brought along, but I didn't even really have much time to eat, especially since I chose to go hiking earlier. So, uh, let's go home. <laughs> So I actually just got done doing all of my textbook research and finishing purchasing all of my textbooks. I have all of my notes from today and I was just looking through them, looking through what I have to do, my syllabus materials and everything. A lot of it's actually online, which I guess is good because then we're not wasting this much paper. But yeah, now textbook stress is over with. It's good because I normally never get all my textbooks on the first day and then I'm just like anxious about it for at least a week. So I'm glad I got it done today. That was nice. And then I actually have one that's online and two that I'll pick up tomorrow. And then my fourth class doesn't use the textbook. So that's the tea. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I am not gonna lie, it is now 9.21 p.m. I actually made myself another tea. This has been so good. It's what I show you guys this morning. It is the decaf vanilla chai with a little bit of hemp milk. It is so, 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 so good. <laughs> um, and now I'm literally just watching YouTube and I'm probably gonna work on as much homework as I can without my books. Um... I think I can actually do all my homework without my books, but I want to look over my books when I pick them up tomorrow. So I think this is going to conclude the vlog because I'm literally just going to be watching YouTube and maybe doing some homework and maybe streaming for the rest of the night. So that's all that I'll be up to. But I wanted to thank you guys for watching this video. This was pretty much my first day after transferring from community college and after getting my associate's degree. So I hope you enjoyed, hope you learned something new. And yeah, I hope you have a good rest of your day. Thanks so much for watching and until I see you next, peace.